Well, first of all, it all started about five, six years ago. I, when I was travelling around as a model, I, I don't know, I ended up starting getting these emails from people um, just asking me about health, fitness, which agencies to go to, which countries were best, uh, how did I do this, how did I do that, and I was just emailing back and then over time I started to realise, you know what, like, people need some information and then I realised when I started I didn't have anybody to help me as well. And so the whole process started about four or five years ago and it was just one of those I just knew there was a, a need for something and when I came to Malaysia I realised that it was a big, big need. Um, when I was working with clients they were asking me about talent, about agents, you know, about uh, different agencies around the world that could bring their models here and I realised that actually there's a lot of talent in Malaysia but for some reason that nobody's really giving them the information or should I say in my opinion the correct information uh, to really help them progress um, whether that's locally or internationally so yeah a few reasons um, the main one being that I saw a really big potential in, in people here to progress to change uh, to improve their their careers um, based on my experience and my knowledge um, which you know, it's really cool and I love, I love the fact that I'm helping people, um, so it's a, it's a big passion. Big passion. So I have the, it, my company is called Role Models um, and I have the Role Models Create and the Role Models Academy. Uh, the Role Models Create is, in, is a company that deals with branding, so we look at branding other businesses. Uh, we do photo shoots, video shoots, we build websites, graphic design, we do logos and we help them build their branding uh, based on all those elements, which is very visual stuff. Yeah, it's very creative, very visual things. And I've built up a team over the last two years now who are all experts in what they do. You know, graphic design, photography, videography, editing, styling, you know, and everything's really coming together and uh, the role models create companies really starting to kickstart now. And that's just, crazy, insane, and I love it. I'm really, really pleased, really happy, yeah. Well, five years initially is to make this business as good as I can. <laughs> also to develop the academy. Um, but not only that, I've got to stop putting so much pressure on business, because I, I sometimes get so much focus that I forget about myself. And recently I became a little bit sick, um, and I was off ill for about three or four days, and couldn't eat. Uh, sick every day and uh, made me realign some focus and I think sometimes we need that just to sit back and I've now realized that I need to take some lifestyle changes as well so in the next five years it's definitely going to be business orientated but also my own personal lifestyle you know how I want to live my life for example getting up every morning going to the gym rather than coming straight to the office you know going on holiday even if it's just for two days every month the fantastic thing about being in Asia is that I can do that and it's fairly cheap. So I've got to take some priorities for myself because when I'm looked after for myself then I can also then bring more to my businesses and more to the people that I'm dealing with. Um, nothing worse than dealing with people and being stressed. You're not going to help them and you're certainly not helping yourself. So yeah, it's been a nice shift, it's been a nice shift the last couple of weeks and I'm excited to really explore that lifestyle and vision for, the, for going forward over the next five years, definitely. Yeah, yeah, um, with the student, I mean, we're very new, so we, I mean, we've just had the Academy weekend, uh, which was your big break, and absolutely went fantastically. Um, could never ask for something better than that, especially for our first, our first seminar weekend. So we had nearly 100 people turn up. Um, we've had sign-ups, which is absolutely in, yeah, amazing, and I'm really looking forward to, uh, to working with those new students. Some of them have experience, some of them don't. The people who we were working with before this weekend, uh, a few of them were new into the industry. One of them was a 44-year-old man who you would never think would start modeling, and we transformed him because of his new dream, his new target. Um, we helped somebody gain so much confidence in just one photo shoot. And, um, for me, all these different levels, all these different per people, um, it just it just keeps inspiring me to just help and to just keep going with the academy. Um, so different levels, you know, everybody's at different levels, and we've understood that 
from the academy point of view and what I know and what I've learned over time is that everybody is different and you, you have to have the same foundation of knowledge but really it's got to be pinpointed to each individual so that's what the academy is about yeah bringing the individual out for their for their unique selling point I mean if you're doing branding you have to know unique selling points and it's the same for people as well as business um, I know so many models who are really really extremely intelligent and they know exactly what they want they're going for it they're using their beauty uh, and I agree with that completely you know you've got to use what you've got you know each of us have individual skills and techniques um, people can talk very well people can look like they do they've got the knowledge of something you know you've got to use what you've got and at the end of the day beauty attracts people it does and it's not being superficial about it it's just the honest truth you know everybody wants to look as good as they can and use it you know, but use it wisely and don't be, don't be arrogant about it, but have confidence in what you have and that goes for everybody really. Um, but beauty and brains, of course it exists. The myth is flawed <laughs> with many, many, many examples. <laughs> so what I want to do is over this next five, ten years is really help the industry here in Malaysia, help the people who want to become something, who want to be successful, and my experience, my knowledge, and the team that I have can really help people build their branding, look at their niche, look at their portfolios, their Polaroids, their videos. We can create that whole branding experience for them so that they can become more professional. So, really exciting times. I've been in the industry now for 10 years, and quite frankly, before I set up the Role Models Academy, I did a lot of research. A lot of information about the industry. I tried to find my competition. I tried to see who else was doing what I wanted to do. And in actual fact, anywhere in Malaysia or even in the world, nobody's doing what we're doing right now. And that's really exciting for me. That's really exciting for the people who come to these events and also the new students who actually have just signed up for the Role Models Academy Mentorship Program. I'm Carl Graham. Thanks for watching Business Models.